Hi guys, this is going to be quite a quiet one I'm afraid. I know it's been a while since we last did a video, but it, a, lot of ha a lot has happened since then. So we've obviously got a new baby boy. Um, he's doing really well, nice and healthy. Mum's doing really well. We're all great, just a bit tired, <laughs> as I'm sure you uh, um, can all imagine. Um, but yeah, everything's going great. Um, now, unfortunately, when it comes to the, the pack openings, I'm afraid Pokey 2 has now just become Pokey 1 because uh, other little boy, um, Poker Alex, has gotten a bit bored of it. So it's just going to be me from now on. Um, I'll try and throw out a video every now and again. Um, um, don't expect them to be too often, I'm afraid. But we'll, I'll give it a go, but I enjoy it, and I've got some stuff to open, and I'll keep opening it. If you guys hopefully will enjoy it, hopefully next time I'll be able to be a bit louder. Um, but obviously, at the moment, just trying to keep the voice down uh, so we don't wake up mum and baby since they've finally managed to get off to sleep after quite a bit of time um so i hope you guys enjoy this i'm just going to be opening a bit of fusion strike today um i did originally purchase the box for my own personal collection but not for my own sealed collection that is but yeah it, unfortunately due to poor packaging which i'm sure a lot of you can relate to i accidentally broke the seal on the box when i was opening the packaging because it was in there too tight, which is really annoying, but it's only an ETB, it's not the end of the world. But it is a Pokemon Center ETB, so I wasn't really wanting to open it. I was wanting to keep it for my sealed collection. Um, never mind, it doesn't matter. I love a bit of Fusion Strike. Um, but yeah, anyway, hope you guys enjoy this. All right, so here we are with the box. So as you can see, we've got a Fusion Strike Pokemon Center Elite Trainer box. Um, Mew is my favourite Pokemon, which is why I had bought it for my personal collection. I knew Fusion Strike isn't everyone's favourite set, but I really like it, and I still haven't pulled a Gengar yet. I really love that Gengar. I've already purchased, I think, all of the Mews from this set, because I just love Mews, and I've got quite a large collection of Mews. I'm still missing a couple of the old ones, but yeah, I'll get them eventually. Some of them are quite expensive, as I'm sure you know. Yeah, this is the little, this is the, the culprit here. Uh, this is the damage that I accidentally did. And well, at least it makes opening the box a little bit easier, I guess. Uh, see everyone opening up these Elite Trainer boxes with a Stanley knife and things. And I really don't understand why. It's so easy just to rip the plastic off. Like it literally takes no effort whatsoever. Uh, with very little damage to the box at all like I don't understand why anyone would ever have a problem with that but anyway as you can see up in the corner I've already opened up one of these before um, and I've also purchased a third one to stay in my personal collection hopefully I don't rip the seal on that one as well otherwise we'll be here yet again um, I don't actually I've not collected the whole set of this I like I just literally like the muse and I'm really after that Gengar I'm not gonna go for all this book I'm sure no one really wants to see that yeah, let's just get straight into it. Let's see what we can get from this. I'm not going to do anything fancy here. In fact, let's just pull the whole thing out. But yeah. Okay, what have we got? Let's do a little bug. And Genesex sleeves. Genesex sleeves? I thought this came with new sleeves. I swear my other pack came with new sleeves. Or oh, is it new sleeves? Oh, new sleeves is N Genesex sleeves. And I might actually use those new sleeves. Kept the other one sealed, so that I could, oh, I don't know, just, I like keeping things sealed, as I'm sure you've probably guessed. Um, code card, if anyone wants it, yeah, there we go. What are you doing, Doc? Doc's just sort of uh, patting on the floor for no reason. Uh, get rid of all that. over to one side. Oh, shall we start off with a nice Gengar? Hopefully this means we're actually going to get the Gengar. I know that's a load of rubbish. I'm sorry. If I talk a little bit of rubbish, then I'm quite tired to be fair. Alright, it's okay. It's okay. Sorry, just have to come to the dog a little bit. She's getting a little bit... I think she's getting a little bit lonely. The baby's got obviously a lot of the attention. And uh, she's just... She was so used to being center of attention that 
just that. Now she, um, yeah, she'll get over it. She's been a bit weird recently. Code card for what's that? Yeah, that was a motorbike going past. And yeah, I don't know, one, two, three, is it four? I don't know, my brain's literally toast at the minute. Betty. She's just gone off into, her, into Poker Alex's room, so that's great. Okay, so water energy. Sharpedo. Didn't do guess the energy? Oh, well, never mind. Not the end of the world, is it? Dunce Pass. Indeedy. Growlief. Let's get a little bit closer. At least this way, you guys can actually see the cards that I'm, uh, that I'm opening. Um, whereas, obviously, when Poker Alex did it... Wait, hang on. Is that it? Oh, wow. What a loop. Yeah, never mind. Nothing, nothing there at all. Okay, so fusion strike out, strikes out again. Let's put all those to one side. The dog is really going mad. Right, okay, so put the dog to bed. Hopefully she'll be uh, a little bit quiet now. Never mind. Right, okay, so what have we got next? Bolton, a bit of Bolton. Not a big fan of Bolton. And that Genesect thing, I'm not, I mean, I don't know if I got back into the hobby too late, but I don't even remember Genesect. I don't know what it is. I'm assuming it's some sort of legendary thing, but I honestly haven't got a clue. Uh, code card for you guys, there we go. Okay, let's do the card trick again. I mean, when we've only got 10 packs like this, might as well do the card trick. And I forgot again, never mind, fire energy. Oh, do you know what? I've just, I've just gone straight for it. There we go. Toxtricity. There we go. Yeah. I'm that tired. I don't... Yeah, I mean, the fun... The fun... The fun is there. I'm sorry. I will try and be a little bit more enthusiastic when I'm a little bit more awake. I just couldn't help. I just, I've been waiting for days. Days? Has it been days? Has it been weeks? I'm not sure. It feels like weeks. But I think it's only been a couple of days uh, to open this box. And I just couldn't wait anymore. And it just seems such a shame just opening it without showing you guys what I'm getting. Um, so, here we are. Right. So, one, two, three. <laughs> what am I doing? <laughs> so that just shows how tired I am, everyone. One, two, three, four. I mean, I don't, at this point, I don't think it really matters, does it? We're just going to get straight to it. Oh, we've got a Pikachu V. Nothing too fancy, but at least it's actually something. Let's go on to another gen. How many Genesect are oh, there? Another Gengar, Gengar, there's another Mew. I mean, I'll be happy with another Mew. I mean, I think I've got, as I said, I've got them all, but I'll be quite happy to get another one. Uh, Quillfish. Big puff of fish. Puffer, puffer. Oh, and I just did that by accident, so yeah, never mind. Uh, one, two, three, four. Lightning in it. We are just gonna run through and absolutely nothing. Add it to the bulk. The bulk all goes to Poker Alex. Well, I mean, he doesn't look at them, he doesn't use them. I mean, it will still go to Poker Alex anyway, because I mean, what am I gonna do with it? I could sell it for 5p a card, but like, it's just not worth it, is it really? And I've done it again, I'm really sorry. Like, yeah, anyway, there's nothing in there either. We'll just skip straight to the end. Look at that. There it is. A Landros. Wow. That Gengar is looking further and further away. But, you know, we've got to stay positive. We've got to stay positive. You never know. It could be in that last pack. That last pack magic. All we can do is keep on hoping. All we can do is try. If all we get out of this box is a Pikachu V, I am not... Well, to be fair, it's not the end of the world. It's nice just to open up some cards. Like, it's been, feels like it's been quite a while. I mean, it has been quite a while. I mean, Hector, so that's our little boy's name. Our little baby boy is called Hector. Uh, he's, he was two weeks old yesterday. I want to say it was yesterday. Yeah. Um, oh, that's cute. Um, yeah, two weeks old yesterday. Um, he was very healthy. He was a big boy. I think I don't work in pounds, so in kilograms, I think he was 9.4, which I think is pretty a pretty hefty boy. Um, but he is really healthy, and he is absolutely beautiful. 
another bolt on the back. There was a point to that story, it was going somewhere, but I don't know, never mind. Probably should have done this, try to do it a little bit earlier in the day, rather than waiting until half ten at night, but here we are, never mind. And we've got a healing up tile. I don't think I've seen that one before. I don't know, maybe I just don't pay that much attention to the to the commons that much. Let's have a little look then. I'm gonna try and remember. We are gonna guess fighting energy. And mm -hmm, mm -hmm, what have we got here? Payukamuka. What? I don't, yeah. As I said, I, I missed a little bit. I mean I only got back into the hobby a few months ago. So there's a lot of Pokemon I just, just I'm not aware of really. Like Corbis. Like some sort of weird pink fish thing. I have no idea. Right. I'm more into the old, the originals. I've recently finished a celebration set. I'm gonna try and do a, a base set as well. Like just for the nostalgia purposes. You know, it's all about that nostalgia. I mean, I think that's why Pokemon has become so big as it is, just because everyone that was a kid when it first came out is now sort of going through a little midlife crisis and uh, going back into it. <laughs> Correct me if I'm wrong, but I think that's the reason why. That's why everything's so expensive. Uh, uh, I forgot to do the guess the energy again. Never mind. Right, what have we got here? Grabler, Toxel, Staryu, Mawile, Ma, Kuhita, Panpo, Rotom, and I'm guessing nothing. Latius. I know there is one of these cards that's worth quite a lot of money, and I think they're heart shaped. I could might be something different. I don't know. Never mind. Just ignore me. Right. Okay. Genesect and a Bolton. It's not looking good, guys, but I am still holding out for that last pack magic, or even second to last pack magic. Any magic will do at this point. Let's have a look. What have we got here? We are nearly there. Right, let's have a look here. Code card. There you go. One, two, three, four. Yeah, I forgot again, didn't I? It's just not going to happen tonight. Oh! There's something there, there's something there. I'm not just gonna get a Pikachu V out of this box. I'm probably gonna get another V. <laughs> and let's have a little look. Skarmory, Shelmet, Plusle, Moon. I like Moon, it's really cute. Uh, I like the cute ones, which is why I like Mew. I think Mew's the cutest one. That's a really nice Mew up, actually. And Primeape, and we've got a Taranatar V. Yes, another V. So. This is it, guys. Last pack magic. Give me something other than a V. Now, at least I didn't keep this box sealed for sort of 10 years and then get really excited. Ah, oh, there we go. Never mind them. Light border. At least I didn't keep this pack sealed for 10 years and get really excited about opening it and then come to this and here we are. Nothing. Smurgle. Havana, na na, to copy Leon Hart. Campo, or Pico, and there's nothing in this one because I just. Yeah, there's nothing there. What happened there? Did I not do the card trick? I thought I did. Never mind. Call of Night. Wow. So there you have it, guys. Fusion Strikeout strikes out again. All we have are two Vs and a lot of bulk that will go and live in some tins in Poker Alex's bedroom forevermore, never to be opened. You never know, maybe in 10 years time, they'll be worth loads of money. We both know that's not gonna happen, but you never know. So there we go, those are the two hits from a Pokemon Center Elite Trainer Box for Fusion Strike. Uh, centering is terrible on the Pikachu, slightly better on the Tyranitar, not that it really matters. I mean, we just wanted that Gengar really, didn't we? Anyway, thanks for watching, guys. Sorry, it's not the usual fun and games that me and Poker Alex had together. Hopefully I'll get back into it at some point. You never know, I'll try and persuade him somehow. <laughs> um, anyway, right, until next time, guys. Thanks for watching.